Coach, did uh, Matt Murray set the tone in this one in the first period? For sure he did. He was dialed in right from the get-go uh, and was even better there in the third. So um, he dialed in, gave our, gave our team a chance to, to get our feet going and, uh, and uh, certainly was the best player on the ice for us. And you get a sense on the bench of what a goaltender can do when he was uh, when he when a goaltender is that consistent? For sure, uh, you can see the confidence he was in it. He was seeing the puck, um, you know, and then and then that confidence feeds on our bench and gave us enough time to get going and make some plays. And then uh, we found a way to score, and then it looked like we loosened up and got going. What did you like about the third period and the ability to clamp down on the lead? Other than a couple shifts, uh, we did a good job taking care of the puck. Um, certainly they had a push, but, um, you know, we did a good job as a whole. I thought we tracked really well. I thought we helped our D, um, and our D kept them off the goalie for, for most of the night. Chris Carriott, Post Media. Hey, DJ, a couple links for you. Just, uh, what are you seeing Drake Batherson right now? I mean, he just kind of looks unstoppable at the moment. Well, he makes plays, um, but he's really playing well away from the puck. He's tracking, um, you know what? <laughs> Yeah, he's dangerous every night, and we only had one power play tonight, and, and that's where he's really good uh, is on the power play. So um, he's doing a really nice job five on five. Him and Timmy are making it uh, hard on other teams. Um, tonight it was Norris, no matter who's in the middle. Um, they had a lot of speed, and they were dangerous. It just, um, you think it's become a, a, you did it in the last game, you know, they, they got a, you got up to nothing. They made it to one. You didn't get rattled. Same situation tonight after Luchich scored. Do you think you're you're learning to handle those moments better, DJ? Yeah, for sure we are. And I think we're starting to understand that we can score. Um, you know, so just be patient. We'll get some opportunities, um, you know, where we were really squeezing it at the start. And, you know, we couldn't score more than two goals. So, you know, when you got down, you, you, it was tough to battle back. But right now, I think, you know, when we get a power play, we feel we can score and we and we feel we can make plays and and, and, and get some goals if we are getting down in a game. Ian Mendez, The Athletic. Uh, hey, DJ, just one question for you. What, what's the message or the mood on the bench when uh, Good Branson jumps in to kind of defend Timmy Stutzler, who got hit? Um, I know he negates the power play, but he's also sticking up for a teammate. So what's kind of the, the message from the coaching staff when, when something like that happens? Well, everyone knows uh, you know he's a young guy in the league and he got hit hard from behind and uh, gutty did his job he went in there uh and made sure that uh you know he let him know that, that that's not acceptable um you know it was a dangerous play um and gutty's as tough as anyone in our league um you know and uh, certainly he won't you know he gets a penalty but uh, everyone on the team expects him to do that on a one tonight is from mark broussard at the Dois. Yeah, DJ, with uh, Matt uh, Murray being fairly busy tonight, do you, do you think you could go back to him tomorrow in Montreal? We'll make that decision uh, tomorrow um, and see how he feels. But uh, we're trying to win every game, uh, and, and we'll do our best to do that.